In this video, I am going to start a summary of common stocks and uncommon profits that was written by Philip F. Fisher. This is one of the most important book in investing. So here is a summary of the common stocks and uncommon profits by Philip F. Fisher. So number one point is importance of research. Fisher emphasizes thorough research into a company's management, products, competitive positioning and growth potential before investing. Number two is long term investment, a long term perspective. The book advocates a long term investment horizon focusing on the potential for sustained growth and profitability over time. Number three is scutal but method. Fisher introduced the scutal but approach which involves gathering information about a company through various sources like customers, suppliers, competitors and employees to gain insights beyond financial statements. Number four, quality management. Fisher stresses the significance of capable and visionary management that can drive a company's successes and adapt to changing market conditions. Number five, sustainable competitive advantage. He discussed the importance of companies having a strong competitive advantage, often referred to as moat that protect them from competition and allows for long-term growth. Number six, growth potential. Fisher suggests that investors should focus on companies with the potential for significant growth, even if the initial price might seem high. Number seven, avoid over diversification. The book suggests that investors should focus on a small number of carefully chosen investment rather than spreading themselves too thin. Number eight, market timing. Fisher downplays the importance of trying to time the market and instead emphasizes the significance of selecting strong companies regardless of short-term market fluctuations. Number nine, management's integrity. He highlights the importance of investing in companies with honest and ethical management themes. Number ten, conservative financing. Fisher advises looking for companies with a sound financial structure avoiding those with excessive debt. So if you like this summary then please subscribe my channel and also like my video and also uh, if you are interested in investing in stocks so it is good for you to read the full book and but here only the few important points of this book are written and are summarized. Thank you for watching my video.